Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to episode number 80. We're on 80? Holy mother of poopy. This is insane, all right? Uh, yes, I just said mother of poopy. It's in my vocabulary. Get used to it. Uh, guys, we're on episode 80 of this series, and you guys saw the title. Thank you. Seriously, thank you for all that you do watching this series. Um, this video is inspired by, I just logged onto the server and you guys welcomed me back. We started the conversation about just YouTube and just prison servers and it was really cool to see the humble conversation of just people saying how they found this server through my YouTube videos, my past YouTube videos. And none of this, I wouldn't be making this series if, if literally nobody watched it. Um, you know, if, if I got zero views on every video, I would stop. That's just a fact. But there are people, you guys, who watch my videos and you guys, some of you keep coming back for more videos. And it's apparent that when the YouTube algorithm recommends my videos to you guys, you know, they... You guys click them. They don't have thumbnails, but you guys still click them. And there's a reason why you guys click them, whether it be for, for me, whether it be for the Trapped MC content, whether it be for you're bored and have nothing better to do but watch my videos. I, I don't know what your reason for watching my videos is, but I just want to say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart because, like, here's the thing. Minecraft is not my passion. Minecraft is not my driving force that gets me up every morning. My driving force is not to entertain. You know, I, I do entertain through my videos sometimes, but my driving force is ultimately uh, God. And I have found a way and a platform, YouTube. You know, I found YouTube to be able to share my insights about God and my beliefs through playing this game and through making videos on the server and I think it's really cool how I get a lot of returning viewers even when I do talk about religion and I talk about Christianity and I talk about my beliefs I still get returning viewers and I'm not sure how you know I can look at my analytics to see my average <clears throat> watch time and stuff like that but there's people who watch these videos in their entirety and it's really cool to see because I talk about some pretty deep stuff in these videos and I talk about stuff that is more surface level in other videos but it's really cool to see that people find this server through my videos and people also watch my videos for other reasons but to sum it up I just want to say thank you guys so much for seriously watching my videos and for like just being intrigued by just these videos uh, like I said I don't know the reasoning for why you guys watch me but Thank you. Seriously, you make this series possible. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm getting like, I don't even know. I, it ranges like from like 20 views to like 80, 90, 100 views on, on some of my videos on this series. And it's cool. It is genuinely cool because consistency is key in YouTube, as you guys know. And I, one of my big goals is to get a YouTube play button one day. And I can't get there if I don't stay consistent. Now, there's definitely ways in which I could accelerate that process. The, the first thing could be, oh, Bumpy, you could edit your videos. No, not doing that. <laughs> not doing that. Um, maybe on my other channel, I might edit a little bit, depending on the style I'm going for. But really, I mean, I'm sticking to pretty raw videos here, just raw files of me hitting record, <laughs> recording for 8 to 10 to 20 to 30 minutes on some of my videos. And... That style is, is working for me. Obviously, the YouTube algorithm would prefer I edit some videos and, and make better quality content, but that's not, that's not my mission. My mission is not to make high-quality YouTube content. You know, my mission is to provide hope and to spread the good news of Jesus to people. And, um, you know, here is a platform in which I can do that on YouTube. And... Um, you know, I don't talk about that. Uh, I don't talk about Jesus in every video. I don't talk about God in every video. But I do bring it up. It's something I'm open about, and I've gotten more open about 
over my time of <clears throat> being on YouTube and getting more confident in, in, in my faith. And it's been cool to be able to openly share my beliefs with, with the internet. You know, it's, it's crazy. Um, yeah, it's, it's interesting because there was a point in time where I was very scared to even mention the word Jesus or the word God. But I, I do now. You know, I openly talk about topics that are deep. You know, they're deep topics. They're, they're real. And, um, you know, it's it all boils down to people are watching these videos. You know, people watch these videos. And I don't know the reasons for why. Like I've said like eight times now, but... Man, it's just so cool to have people who are clicking on my videos intentionally. Like, they're saying, hey, I'm going to dedicate a portion of my day to watching Bumpy Plays, mine on a prison server, and talk about who knows what. You know, it's awesome. And I just, that's what this video is all about. I just want to thank you guys for all that you do, for the comments you leave. Guys, if you haven't left a comment, I read all my comments. I would love to see your name in the comment section. And if, if you don't leave a comment, that's totally fine too. But I love reading them. So if you guys don't mind, leave a comment. I love responding. Just It could be something as just saying, hey, great video. Hey, I hated this video. Hey, your video sucks, but you told me to leave a comment, so I did. It could be something like that. And I would laugh. I, I'd be like, man, that's funny. I would laugh because, well, if I remembered that I said this in my videos, but <clears throat> anyways, yeah, any comments are fun to read. I, I, I've been getting more comfortable with being okay with, with hate on my videos. Like I've gotten hate on my YouTube shorts, like about, um, my videos, like, like bumpy. Why do you post the same thing every day? Like bro, nobody plays prison servers anymore. Okay. Stop posting about this server. And then I, I'd be like, no, you stop posting about the server. And then they'll be like, well, I don't post about the server. And I'll be like, exactly. You should be. And, I, uh, and then, yeah, it's, it's just so funny. I'm, I'm like getting more comfortable having people who don't like my content. Because not everyone's going to like my content. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the whole Mr. Beast allegation stuff right now. But he's a great example. You know, he, he's done a lot of things. Good and you know, bad. He came out with a, a new product. Th this is really interesting. I, I could talk about so many things with Mr. Beast, but I'll say this. He came out with a lunch thing called Lunchly. And it has like prime, it has like crackers and cheese and meat or something. Like, he, on Twitter, he said his mission, mission statement is to provide a healthier alternative than Lunchables. What? We all know daggone well that's not your mission statement. That That is not your purpose of making that. Your purpose of making that is more exposure and for money. You don't have to be so bogusly obvious about what your mission is. Dude, anyone can see that a prime and crackers and cheese or whatever like dude that your mission is not to create a healthier alternative for lunchables like stop talking like i'm i i don't usually get triggered when it comes to like mission statements or what people like believe but that one was so blatantly clear that it was just a bunch of bullcrap i don't know like with all the stuff going on with Mr. Beast, I saw that and I'm like, dude, you don't give a crap about how healthy your stuff is, bro. You're selling chocolate to people and claiming it has five ingredients. Like, bro, I don't care how many ingredients you have. You cannot make the argument that chocolate is a healthy alternative to anything. Bro, I'm just saying. There's a lot of sus stuff happening in that whole thing. I might have to make another video on Mr. Beast all, all together. <sighs> but I, I really jumped topics there. But guys, the moral of the story is thank you so much for watching my videos. I really do appreciate it. Thank you all so, so much for what you do. Be sure to leave a comment. I love reading your comments. Be sure to leave a like. Smash the like button, man. 
smash the like button. Oh, wait. I have one, I think. I think I, I think I have one for, for, for Dan here. I think I have a dust. I do. Let's go. Let's let's help my boy, Gamer Dan. Helping my boy Dan out. All right, we're helping our boy Dan out with an ultimate dust. It's going to be pretty epic. Hello, Sir Dan. There we go. The good deed of the day. That's awesome. Um, but guys, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I wanted to help my boy Dan out. I knew I had some dust that could help him. With that being said, guys, thank you so much for all that you do. I really appreciate it. Consider buying a membership for $2.99 per month if you would so choose. We're at four out of eight members. We're trying to get to that five threshold if we can. It could be you. Just saying. I'm trying to get everybody on the front page of my channel and say, and, and it would say, thank you, channel members or something. It'll be really cool. I'm really trying to get there. So um, consider that. With that being said, guys, it's going to wrap it up for now. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Peace.